the mic with Mike. On the mic with Mike. On the mic with Mike. Okay. On the mic with Mike. I'm on the mic with Mike. He's like a guru. No, he's a businessman with a great radio show. And he supports the non-profits. Watch it go and grow. I enjoy listening to On The Mic With Mike every day. You don't want to miss Mike and Biz Radio. The king of RVA business talk radio on ESPN 106.1 FM, The Choice 105.3, and worldwide on IBGR.network. Mike King Biz Radio. Ladies and gentlemen, ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to On the Mic with Mike. We are the premier business radio program around. I'm your host, Mike King. Appreciate you being here with me. You know, when I'm out in the streets, uh, out in Richmond and moving about, we hear about people out there who are doing some amazing things. We hear the buzz in the streets. We are just a humble talk show. I'm hearing all of this buzz about the Ground Up podcast. And you know what I do? Hey, we got to make it happen. So I got the brain trust in the building. The podcast is here. They are podcasters extraordinaire. Welcome to the program. Thank you. Thank you. I'm so happy to be here. I'm happy to have you guys because you know what? This is a big day. All right. So I always say this is a, let's get the elevator picture, who you guys are and what you do. Okay. We are the Ground Up Podcast. I'm Keisha Rock. And I'm Aaron Rock. And what we do is we share entrepreneur and creatives, entrepreneur stories, how they built their business from the ground up. Right. Yeah, that's what we do. And um, just um, entrepreneurs and business owners, and we're trying to share those stories. Yeah, right. we, we share ahead. those stories. And then we're also small business owners. We own Golden Touch Mobile Detailing, and we come to you car wash, detail service. So we know the journey. We're experiencing the journey. And we know how important having, hearing relatable experiences and inspiration and motivation to keep going in your entrepreneur story. How'd you, where'd the birth of the ground of podcast come from? Well, I've always been a lover of podcasts. like, And, and I've always loved entrepreneurship. So yeah, he's always had entrepreneur dreams. So you're down with the hustle. Yeah, oh, he's down with day. the hustle. Oh, yeah. down with the hustle. And the know, personality. <laughs> I can tell. Yeah. And so you got, the, you know, because the hustle folks, we, we get, understand. Everybody always say they hustling. Right, right. Everybody's right. out there grinding. But you know who is and who's not. Exactly. Yeah. You know. <laughs> you know, because the work is telling who is out there. So how do you create a buzz for to create the buzz that you guys have going right now? Because you guys got the buzz happening in this show. I would say consistency. So that's one of the big things we talk about on the Ground Up podcast. Get started. Stop waiting to think things are going to be perfect. Actually start doing something and right. keep doing it. Keep putting yourself out there. Keep blowing up your own head. You got to be confident. You better. That's yeah. tell you. Exactly. Talent. We the best, baby. Yeah, we the, the best. best. That, we that's, the best. What we, that's what we do out here. So when did all of a sudden you start realizing we had a little bit of juice going on in the streets? We were at the park. We were at <laughs> Bell Isle in Richmond, and we were just taking our son KJ on a little stroll, and somebody stopped us on the bridge and said, are y'all the ground up? Po- I'm also always wearing always the, the wearing. ground up podcast Explain to merch. these people what that yes. is. Yeah, we, we just, we feel like we need to represent ourselves everywhere we go. So we get our own merch made, and we sport it, and we rock it. But we were at the park. Someone stopped us and said, are y'all the ground up podcast? And we said, yeah, we are. We took a picture. <laughs> they told us what episode they loved. Right. And we realized people are starting to really know who we are and listen. They, okay, let's give a shout out to people who does your merch. We, what we do here is we show a lot of people. All right, yes. who does the merch for a you? A very good friend of mine, Amber um, Harding. She owns Vinyl Creations by Amber, and she puts together all our, we got masks, you know, COVID friendly. We got masks. We have our T-shirts, our sweatshirts. So, yeah, she, she she's good at what us, she does. So, yeah. And the name of her business is? Vinyl Creations by Amber. You can find her on Instagram and Facebook. All right, Amber, you're doing some great work out yeah. there. All right, so uh, when you're out making magic happen, let's talk about what's going on in the streets of Richmond. So yeah. from a hustling standpoint and from okay. the entrepreneurial side, what's happening in the streets? Well, I'm seeing a lot of I'm seeing a lot of entrepreneurs stepping out there and trying to you know share their stories and stuff and i felt like that's where we came in to uh fill that void give them a voice to share their story so i'm seeing entrepreneurs getting it they're making more businesses coming out i'm seeing a lot more people taking um steps towards 
uh, gaining some some of their own. I, I don't know the word to say, but that, that just that 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 power of ownership, like that, you know? yeah. the power in the ownership. Yeah, right. and I think also a big thing right now is people are realizing they can monetize off of their natural gifts. Right. So people are realizing, hey, I'm creative. You know, I have a personality. You can just monetize off of being who you are. You know, so now people are building businesses around creativity and. But a lot of the times people don't know how to do that either. So that's something I think that's important with our show is we also bring on artists. We bring on musicians. We bring on people who have built from the ground up, but not necessarily your typical, you know, type of business. On the mic with my ESPN Richmond is part of Mike King Biz Radio Network, which is ESPN Richmond, 5 to 7 a.m. That is 106.1 a choice, 105.3 every day from 2 to 3, as well as International Business Growth Radio. We're here talking to you about what's happening in the streets. We got the Ground Up podcast. Let's talk about what the name, where the name came from. Interesting. Man, I'm just telling you, when you are getting something up off the ground, you yeah. really, <laughs> you feel like you really have to start building roots and like you're building it from the ground up. We didn't have, we didn't know anything about how to start a podcast. podcast nah. We YouTube University. YouTube you University. Know? There you go. <laughs> that is an exclusive. Well, it's not even exclusive. <laughs> everybody knows, but everybody knows it's there, but everybody doesn't take advantage of it. Yes. Yeah. Everybody does not take advantage mm -hmm. of what's going out on out there. When people talk about the idea that everyone has a podcast, how do you monetize, which is always important? How do you monetize that? Because in uh, when uh, besides that, you're just talking to hear yourself. I mean, this is not a venture to be talking right. and making money. That's why we say the microphone ain't free. Plus, my grandkids do need stuff. Yeah. So your son, he needs stuff. Yeah. So I mean, how do we, you monetize it? For us, we've been doing ad space sponsorship. So finding other local small businesses, because that's who our audience are. Our audience are RVA listeners, majority. Right. It's like 86% people from RVA. So people want to hear businesses that they know of, that they love. And we need to put them on our podcast. Okay, so you want to shout out some of your sponsors right now? Oh, What's yeah. It? Okay, come yeah. on now. That's the time. Well, we got one, you know, we got Golden Touch Mobile Detail. Yes, our own business. That's of our own business. And, yeah, um, we also have um, Rylan Lamar of Lamar Marie Gourmet Popcorn. We have Shelly of Shelly's Gift Shop. We had... Where's uh, Shelly's Gift Shop at? So she just opened a few months ago a brick and mortar. She's always been online, but she's on Main Street, VCU campus. Okay, there we yeah. go. Yes. Yeah, so we, we, we are getting the small business owner support in the city. We're sharing light. We're shining light. And we're trying to do our own thing. We're trying to make some money out here, too, with our own ownership. Right. One of the things, so let's talk about the mobile detail. And that was something that... That's true. So you go to people where they are. Yes. So there's no need for you to be riding around looking all busted. No, nah, no need at all, man. You can call us up. Like I said, call us up. Go to touch get you right. detailing, and I'm going to get you right. And um, yeah, I'm looking to grow that as well. Like I said, everything is about growth with me growing and just like having ownership. So, yeah. And that's just the blueprint for, for us. This is just the beginning to really learn how to build a business from the ground up and legitimize it, do it the right way. And from there, sky's the limit. On the mic, good mic. I'm here with the great folks from the Ground Up Podcast coming to you from ESPN Studios. So you guys, how do you pick what guests, how do guests get on your show? Because I, I, you, your, your dance card is full. I know people want to get on there. <laughs> oh, yeah. And everybody, everybody can't get on. Right. So how do you determine who's and who's been some of the people who came on recently? Yeah, recently we just had uh, Dr. Faith Wilkerson of Unlocking RBA. Oh, yeah. So everybody knows Dr. Faith. Yes. See, now that's in this business, when she comes on, I've seen the pictures too. Mm -hmm. <laughs> when Dr. Faith comes on, it, so it's on, on point because yeah. she has, she got the, the, the scene in Richmond yeah, on lock. Exactly. She does. So shout out to and, Faith. And so we try time. to find people who are making waves, who are creating a buzz. But we also try to find people that people just don't know are dope yet. That's you right. know, we want to give exposure to people who we see working and other people see working, yeah, but they haven't see. got they haven't got the, deten the attention they deserve yet. So, for example, Joy Junior Treats is a bakery off West Broad Street. She's new to the city, but she's doing her own thing. And her mom is huge in Lynchburg, Virginia, but Richmond ain't on to her yet. But we Wait had her on second. the show. Okay, so who is she? Yeah, see, Kristen. Here. Her name is Kristen. Um, Joy Junior Treats, she just opened her bakery. I would say about maybe five months ago right, right, and right. people ain't realized it yet. So we also try to get people that we see doing things that necessarily haven't got the spot like they deserve yet. So when you're doing it at a high level, I'm yeah. sorry. Because yeah. you guys are, you guys are putting people on and exposing people. So you had low one, didn't you? 
Yes, so, yes. Okay. The, the collective, yeah. So the collective, I remember when you hear something like that, you're exposing people who've never heard him, even though they're on Broad Street, a lot of people know. Yeah. But you are giving them a platform, mm -hmm. and it's an important platform. Let's talk about what it means, ownership, when you, when you look at your son. You know, yeah. mom and dad's right. out there, you know, building something of their own. Right. It, you, that way somebody else can't come and take it away from you, all the entrepreneur things that are happening. Yeah. And we always, like, our last name is Rock, so we're the Rocks. And we always say our name. We always say who we are because we feel like for him one day, we want him to be out in the community in RVA. And people say, oh, that's the Rocks kid. Yeah. You know, that's KJ. That's the Rock kids. Because your name is everything. So ownership, putting your name out there, being confident in who you are, and being a good representation of yourself. Like, we think about, you know, what we're putting out there to the, to the masses. We actually, we take time to, to really think about it because it's a representation of our family. On the mic, good mic, ESPN, Richard Natural Radio. You guys remind me of friends of mine. They have a program. A uniquely diverse. It's uh, Laj uh -huh. Shawana Kingdom and Rebecca Mann. They have a show on, on the choice. They one here as well. They're uniquely diverse. They help businesses get exposure. And also they have a nonprofit to it as well. Uniquely, oh, it's coming. Oh, it's coming. Uniquely yes. diverse. Uh, on the mic with Mike ESPN here with the Ground Up Podcast. I'm here with The Rocks. They are out there doing some big things. Proud to have them on the show. Uh, we got to take a break for a moment. On the mic with Mike, uh, the best around, ESPN Richmond, the choice, 105.3 every day. We're in seven days a week. Last year, we gave away 19,000 minutes of free air time Ooh. to nonprofits and businesses. Why? Because we got great sponsors. So make sure you check out our sponsors and advertisers. Show them some love. We'll be back in a moment. Hi, this is Andy. Make sure you check out the King Biz. His program, On the Mic with Mike Gorvier, is the best business ish radio program in RVA. Mike King Biz Radio can be heard on ESPN Richmond 106.1 and The Choice 105.3. Me and Minnie listen every day, and you should too. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back. On the mic with Mike in honor of the Rocks coming here. We we brought out the, the all-stars, uh, and we rolled out the welcome mat. We ain't saying no names <laughs> because our legal department <laughs> may say, don't say names like they say allegedly. It is who you think it is. We got the Rocks with the Ground Up podcast. Welcome back, folks. What's up? What's up? So happy to be here. All righty. So how can people find you after? We got to get that out the way. Oh, yeah. You can find us on Instagram at the Ground Up Podcast. You can find us on YouTube at the, the Ground, Ground Up, Up podcast. podcast. Easy to find <laughs> Apple Podcasts, Spotify. We're everywhere. All righty. So for people who are not podcast experts like me, how do you get the, that's the back end monetization of it mm -hmm. the, on all of the platforms. How do you do that part? Well, what we do, we um, use a platform called Anchor. Mm -hmm. And with Anchor, they um, distribute all our recordings to all the different platforms such as google apple um uh spotify all that yeah stuff. and then anchor pays us based on how many downloads we get so right. i mean it's not like you're not gonna be making like crazy money with anchor but at least you are getting that monetization and then you can go on to create ad space sponsorships like we did to create some bigger income coming in so one of the things is you guys working let's talk about the detailing coming, you guys, that's up close yeah. and personal. Golden right. Touch Mobile There you go, detailing. Golden Touch. All right, let's talk about what type of services you guys offer. Yeah. All right, so what we do is we do uh, hand washing, um, car wash on uh, interior and exterior, um, um, carpet cleaning, stain cleaning, and we um, basically detail your car, get your car looking as good as we could possibly get it and smelling good too. Yeah, Golden Touch. Yeah. Golden Touch. Okay, we're out there talking to businesses, business people. What can uh, the Ground Up Podcast do for businesses? Because you guys are looking for sponsorships. You're looking for people with ad space. Let's talk about what that means. I, I'm out there. And what do you see from businesses who come to talk to you? What's the one thing that they seem to be missing that you guys can help with? Exposure. I mean, they, oh, need, there you go. they need a lot of it. You just dropped it like that. Of course, <laughs> man. <laughs> Exposure. Exposure. And also exposure. and exposure, but also giving them the platform to tell the people what they want them to know. One of the questions I always ask the business owners is, what do you want RVA to know about you? And it gives them that opportunity to let them to let them know if they have an event coming up or if they are looking to hire, you know, or we give them that platform to say what they need to the community. There you go. On the mic with Mike, I got the rocks here with us. When you guys are what day 
do you guys shoot video as well? So all yeah, of your so videos. If you're not yeah. in the podcast and you rather watch this pretty face. There you go. YouTube. <laughs> all, we're, we're all over YouTube. Yeah, so, all over what's YouTube. the difference? Would you say with when people want it by video? The importance of video over. Well, if you're like us, we watch YouTube like people watch TV. So right. if you're a person that like you will turn on the YouTube channel and and like you watch it like TV, then you can watch us like a talk show. You can watch us like a, it's an interview. Yeah. So it's definitely you definitely get a different vibe to see the vibe that we had with that guest that we're interviewing. What are some of the cool things happening out in Richmond now? Oh, my goodness. Well, like we said, we she had, said oh, my goodness. That, well, there's so much. Thing, yeah. Like I mentioned earlier, so many creatives that are just doing their thing and giving and putting it out there so like we said unlocking rva all the events that she has the brunch on the plaza um then you also have um, hip-hop bingo yes. with, our, with our girl wound um wham no whams. yeah no wham she does hip-hop bingo at pig and brew every thursday she all, she's also doing croaker spot hip-hop bingo on wednesdays right. um so there's there's things i've never heard of that one. Oh yeah yeah hip-hop bingo that's something that's, bingo. that's fun trust it's me it's a good time that's how folks out there making a difference like you say you can take what your strength is and monetize it Absolutely. And you are your own brand. There's no need for you to be walking around with anybody else's name. No, nope. no. Nah. Round up podcast. Round up podcast. <laughs> That's what you do out here. So on the mic with Mike. Uh, one last time, how can people find you? Find us on Instagram at the Ground Up Podcast. Find us on Facebook at the Ground Up Podcast, and wherever you listen to podcasts and YouTube. All right, on the mic with Mike. We're we're out because we got to run, but it's great it's talking so to you. You guys fun. are going to come back. We got to have you over on a choice. Yeah. Uh, one hundred five point three. That's where we're going to be at. The next time, but keep on doing big things. Thank you. Send it to family now. Thank and you. we got to make sure we check out the uh, the detail. And folks, the oh, summer yeah. is oh, coming. Yeah. We come don't, to you. Don't be riding around with your butt ride looking all busted. <laughs> no, 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 no. Go out there and support these entrepreneurs. You're out there doing some great things. Great podcast. The buzz you guys got in the streets is incredible. Thank, Thank you. So incredible. Much. We appreciate you, Mike. On the mic with Mike, we bring you the best and brightest. We'll talk to you soon. Thanks now.